Make sure somewhere in the chicken crap top scribbling doodling. Hey YouTube, how's it going? It's Willie Jim Sauce, and I'm back with another video. Holy moly, the struggles that I had uploading this. There was like a totally different video other than this one that I had ready, but it was like, nah, man, I don't really want to upload today. Actually, it, it wasn't even uploaded. It didn't even get to render because it was stupid, and I hate my life. Join the French chat, Jim Sauce. Make sure you guys hop in there. So the topic of today's video, as you see by the thumbnail, pretty spooky topic, all right? Pretty, pretty spooky one. By the way, the instrumental in this is uh, Lil Uzi XO Tour Life. Somebody commented like, Oh my god, I didn't know Jib listened to Lil Uzi. Yeah, man, I'm hip. I listen to all that kind of music, man. That's that's what I live by. That's what I that's what I am. So the topic is would you scam a friend? Now I'm not talking about hello, it's me a friend. I'm not talking about Karam Blam a friend. I'm talking about somebody that you met on RuneScape, that you met online, and this doesn't have to apply to only RuneScape. This can apply to any online game. Would you scam a friend now I, I suppose you could argue it depends on the duration of the friendship and how long it's been but for me I got I got a story that I can explain uh, to you guys so basically uh, through my streams and through my videos uh, I've actually met a pretty solid group of people uh, and they know who they are I don't really have to name them they know exactly who they are um, and between that and my like my original squadron of friends that I have in real life um, we've all meshed together into one big happy group uh, of the buds and uh, you know budville and we roam the streets of bud town and it's just great so Although these guys are through the streams and stuff, and although I've met them online, I've also met them uh, IRL a few times. I've met them at the first TwitchCon out in San Francisco, the second TwitchCon in San Diego, and this year uh, I'm turning 21 in a few months, and we're all going out to uh, Miami. So we're gonna be meeting them again. I, you know, I talk to them almost every single day, and these are close friends of mine for the past couple of years now. Um, and one thing that they've always done, and they know I hate it, they, they always trade me stuff. I hate when they trade me things that are super expensive. Like, one of those guys, Kyle, uh, he's traded me his entire bank before, or the majority of his bank. Instantly logged out, went to work, and then didn't trade me back for like four days. So there I was, stuck with his bank on my account, and I just didn't like it. Like, that's just like, I don't like having all that. Like, I don't like having somebody's stuff. It just like sketches me out. Uh, and then for the thumbnail of this video, my boy Joe uh, traded me his Ellie just to go ahead and use and just, you know, to whatever. And Ellie is one of the most expensive items on Old School. And then in this video right now, the Kodai wand that I'm using is actually. Uh, borrowed from him as well so it's like there's been so much money traded to me between these guys and and other you know friends that I've talked to and it's like I could never imagine me scamming them like I could never like sure you could say yeah you could take that Ellie and sell it for like or keep it for 300 mil or you could sell it for $300 or something like that or I could take their bank like on RS3 his bank was like three bill or something like that or or I think his uh his old school bank right now is like uh seven eight hundred mil something along those lines yeah dude you could scam that you'd be loaded or you could sell that and you could I don't know buy a a backpack with freaking I don't know Heelys attached to it something stupid right and it's like I could never see myself scamming them because of the bond and I guess that sounded kind of capital pride uh like just the the friendship and the relationship that I have with these people no amount like even if they traded me 20 bill you know old school it, like whatever it might be I I would never do it like their friendship means way more to me than a you know a stack of pixels on a video game and then you could you could translate this to other things like maybe counter-strike with you know gun skins and knives and everything some of those knives and even some of those skins are worth thousands of dollars um, you know sure it'd be a little spooky trading that on steam and like I said it's it's really all dependent on how long you've been you know quote unquote friends with them um but even even so even before i even got a chance to verbally speak to them in skype or team speak even when they were just you know uh usernames in a in in my twitch chat i i was still cool with them you know i even at that point even even in that point of the friendship before we even actually like heard each other's voices 
I was still cool and I would never do that like there's even people who aren't really like my friends people who come up and they they would like trust trade me items and they trade me stuff or like they'll let me borrow things on stream and like i could have easily taken like an sgs and tacits from this one dude one time or like uh this other guy i forget what he traded me he traded oh he traded me like full uh zora gear which it was worth like 100 mil or more those people i don't even know remotely and i could have logged out and blocked them and never talked to them ever again but I'm just not that kind of person. So maybe it just comes down to morals and, and how you are as a person. I'm not really sure. Would you scam somebody on a, on a game? Would you scam somebody on RuneScape? A friend on RuneScape? Um, I mean, would you scam people in general? I don't know. I, I'm not that kind of person. I can't see myself doing that. Maybe like 11 year old me or something. But nowadays, can't do it. I appreciate my friends too much. So I love you guys. Thank you for watching. Remember to leave a like down below. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.